ericmother.com. Let's take a look at the charts for Twitter. And we can see here on this two year weekly chart that it did break out about two weeks ago. Or let's say last week. And let's say the breakout was at about the $33 price range. Looks good. On the weekly, looks good. Also because the RSI is above 69.1. More importantly, if we take a look at all data monthly, we can see that the stock has been acting well because it did break out to three-year highs on the RSI. And we also see that it met the minimum requirements for the Moade ultimate breakout by moving to three-year highs. So we can see this breakout here. Now that was at a price, let's call it about $21 when it broke out. It's been acting well. And this breakout was in early November of 2017. So it's had a nice run over the last couple of weeks. What I want to discuss in this video is looks like something is starting to play out here. We can see here it is having a nice day and this is for March 14th, 2018. Nice day up about 6-7% but you might notice that this is not moving the RSI on the daily above 69.1. More importantly, if we take a look at the hourly, we can see that on the hourly we have this improvement in prices right now looks like declining technicals looks like signs of negative divergence which i am saying here looks like this is where you'd want to be careful because the stock has had a nice run we are starting to see negative divergence on the hourly. Keep in mind the RSI setting here is of 26 on the hourly. And actually, we can see this if we go to the two hourly chart. So two hourly chart also confirms this negative divergence. So it looks like if somebody was looking for a reason to take profits or to short the stock, this is where you'd want to do it. After a nice run, if you want to take profits or if you want to short the stock, this emerging negative divergence look looks like it is predicting that the next major trend for Twitter in the coming days, in the coming weeks, in the coming months looks to be lower because of the negative divergence that is creeping up on the hourly and two hourly charts and also on the daily. So if you're looking to sell, if you're looking to book profits, if you're looking to short the stock, this is where I would start looking. Eric Mothers, mother com. As always, good luck, peace, and blessings. E-A-C-S.